Prince William told Chloe Kelly she was so powerful before saying he was so, so proud of Jill Scott during an emotional medal ceremony at the Euro 2022 final, a lip-reading expert has revealed. Captain Leah Williamson and her fellow lionesses beat Germany 2-1 to win the tournament in what was a landmark day for women's football in this country on Sunday night. After the match, the Duke of Cambridge, 40, gave the players heartfelt handshakes, words of encouragement, and even hugs as they made their way down the presentation line following the win. According to Juliet Sullivan, the Royal, who has met the team on a number of occasions as president of the Football Association, offered several members of the team particularly close words of congratulations. She revealed how he told striker Chloe Kelly, who scored the winning goal, well done, you were so powerful. Meanwhile the Duke leaned down to give Jill a heartfelt hug when she approached him in the line, telling her, I am so so proud of you. Scott and Prince William have known each other for around 10 years. Scott actually wiped out the prince with a rather hard challenge at a charity match. The 35-year-old midfielder said, the running joke whenever he sees us is, no yellow cards this tournament Jill. He also told goalkeeper Mary Earps she was amazing, while Nikita Paris was fantastic. Speaking to substitute goalkeeper Hannah Hampton, he said, wow it was incredible. Elsewhere the Duke offered his congratulations to Georgia Stanway, sharing a laugh with her as he said, I bet you can't believe it's happened. Juliet's comments come after Leah revealed that Prince William initiated their hug before she was handed the trophy following Sunday's Euro 2022 final at Wembley. Asked about the hug, and what was said, defender Williamson revealed, I think I went to shake his hand and he said, Leah, bring it in and I said, thank you sir. He was like, I am very proud of you all. Williamson was also thrilled to receive such a heartfelt message of congratulations from the Queen, adding, I am a big fan of the royal family so it means a lot. Williamson, who was only given the armband by manager Serena Wegman in April, could not hold back her emotion after the Lionesses' extra-time victory over Germany. I just can't stop crying, she said on BBC One. Something like this, we talk and we talk and we talk and we finally did it. It's about doing it on the pitch and it'll tell you what, the kids are all right. It is the proudest moment of my life. I am taking everything in, every piece of advice I had was to take every single second in, so I can relive it forever. It'll be reliving that for a long time. The legacy of this tournament is the change in society. The legacy of this team is winners. I love every single one of you, the fans. I am so proud to be English. I am trying hard not to swear. Prince William was on hand to cheer on the Lionesses at Wembley, after sharing a video message with his daughter Princess Charlotte wishing the team luck. The Duke of Cambridge posted a video to his official Twitter account in which he and Charlotte shared their support for the Lionesses. We both want to wish the Lionesses the best of luck tonight, you've done amazingly well in the competition and we're rooting for you all the way. Will exclaimed, before Charlotte chipped in, good luck, I hope you win. 
Dubai, Prince William, a lifelong Aston Villa fan, has previously revealed that both Prince George, 9, and Princess Charlotte, 7, are big football fans. Just last month he met members of the England squad at their St. George Park training ground in Burton-on-Trent, where he mentioned Charlotte was really good in goal. The Queen led members of the royal family in paying tribute to England's women's team following their extraordinary performance in the tournament, writing, You have all set an example that will be an inspiration for girls and women today, and for future generations. Prince William added in an Instagram post, sensational. An incredible win at Lionesses and the whole nation couldn't be prouder of you all. Wonderful to see history in the making tonight at Wembley, congratulations.